What is this? Ouch. Has it really been that long? Klaus. I know that sound all too well. You might try picking her up. Hold on. How am I talking to you right now? Where's Stefan? By the way, what's your stance on hand-me-downs? We have a chest that was once owned by Louis XV. It's being wasted on my daughter's outgrown onesies. Any interest? One. These babies aren't mine. They're Rick's. Yes, that's been made abundantly clear to me by your boyfriend. Two. I didn't call you. I called Stefan. Yes, my boyfriend, who's currently running for his life while I sit here playing worst-case scenario. Except these babies that aren't mine. One stop crying and now this entire diner hates me, so if you could refrain from gloating in the face of my misery, that would be very much appreciated. Stefan will be fine. How do you know? Because I will ensure it. So, here you are. In college, building a life for yourself. Plans, a future, things you want. Klaus, I'm not doing this with you. I take it children were not involved in those plans. No, they weren't. Luckily, these aren't mine. So you've mentioned. You know, my family challenges the bounds of my sanity. They drive me to do unspeakable things, all the while finding fresh and inventive ways to torture me. But as it turns out, my family is what makes me truly happy. It's not a crime to love what you cannot explain. I was sorry to hear about your mother, Caroline. I'm sure she would have loved to see you with the little ones. Oh my God, she's finally sleeping. Well then, we mustn't wake her. Goodbye, Caroline.